Mary Kate Olsen is reportedly ending her marriage to Olivier Sarkozy, and she's making a move to get her divorce filing in as soon as possible. According to multiple outlets, the fashion designer signed a divorce petition to legally split from her husband of four years back in April. But it didn't go through. Due to the COVID-19 crisis, New York courts aren't actually accepting any divorce filings right now, except for emergencies. Now, Mary Kate has reportedly applied for her filing to be considered an emergency because she claims that Olivier is ending the lease on their apartment in New York City, effectively forcing her out. His attorneys reportedly gave a deadline of May 18th for her to move out and remove all of her belongings from the apartment. That deadline is nearing closer and closer. And in court docs obtained by Page Six, Mary Kate reportedly says she can't meet it due to the city's stay-at-home restrictions amid the pandemic. The docs read, per Page Six, this application is an emergency because my husband expects me to move out of our home on Monday, May 18th, 2020, in the middle of New York City being on pause due to COVID-19. Adding, I am petrified that my husband is trying to deprive me of the home we have lived in, and if he is successful, I will not only lose my home, but I risk losing my personal property as well. Mary Kate's legal document also touched on how their marriage took a turn for the worse, reportedly saying that their relationship had, quote, broken down irretrievably for a period of at least six months. Access Hollywood has reached out to attorneys for Mary Kate and Olivier, respectively, as well as a rep for the former Full House star. Before their reported split, Mary Kate and Olivier had dated for roughly eight years. She and the French banker, who is the half-brother of former French President Nicolas Sarkozy, tied the knot in New York City in 2015. It was Mary Kate's first marriage and Olivier's second. He previously was married to Charlotte Bernard, with whom he shares two kids.